All right, so you got Calvin Benjamin who just traded the Bills. Okay, let's talk about this for a second. All right, so you trade Calvin Benjamin for a third and a seventh round pick. Okay, trade Calvin Benjamin for a third and a seventh round pick. All right, so the people that we have on our death chart now, Funches, Russell Shepard, Curtis Samuel, Barson, which is a special teams guy, but he plays wide receiver too. Special teams guy. You got the rookie Bard, who we got in the preseason. You got uh, the other guy we just got from Buffalo. I forget his name. But we got that guy. And we got Teddy Williams. Three of those guys I just named play special teams. So, explain to me why the fuck you would make this trade like... I, I'm still trying to figure out. I understand you want Curtis Samuel in the offense more. I get that. Okay, but you can also put Curtis Samuel in the motherfucking slot. Now he has to come out wide because what are you going to do? Throw the fucking punches every single time? It's bad enough. You know, thank God we're getting fucking Olsen back. Because if we didn't get Olsen back, we'd be fucked. This shit is, this shit is annoying, man. I don't, I, every time we make a fucking trade like this, I don't get it. I don't understand. You know, I, I don't get this fucking team. Like, we're five and three. I get it. We're five and three. We're right there. Like, I, I just don't understand why the fuck. Jay, I don't understand why Richardson would let this fucking happen. I understand his contract's up. The end of the fucking year. I'm fucking pissed. I don't I don't I don't understand their fucking logic in this fucking trade. I'm gonna fucking lose my shit. So what are you gonna do? Throw out the fucking punches every five seconds? Cause you Curtis Samuel drops too many fucking open passes. It's as bad as fucking Ted Ginn Jr. is. You get fucking Olsen back, but, you know, God, you know, he's not, he's going to come off an injury, so you're not going to be able to throw him the fucking ball every 10 seconds. Your running game fucking sucks, for one. Okay. Running game fucking sucks. 2.3 yards of fucking carry. Is what we average. I, I just don't get it. I don't understand why the fuck you would make this trade. Especially since you're in a fucking division race with the Saints. And the Falcons. Which we know the Falcons ain't gonna fucking... We know the Falcons at the end of the year always try to win games. So they're gonna be right in the thick of things. So why the fuck would you make a trade... Knowing your offense is spiraling out of control as it is because Cam is inconsistent as fuck. So I don't understand why the fuck you would make this trade. Knowing your offense needs work. Why the fuck would you make this trade then? You know, you're telling me your offense needs to click. Well, you're trading fucking people away that need help the offense click. So why the fuck would you... I don't understand. You, they, they just said in the press conference that the fucking offense needs to click. I don't understand why. How the fuck does this help the offense click? I don't get it. You want to? You want to fucking use? You you want to use Christian McCaffrey less? Okay, so let's trade away Calvin Benjamin to make sure we trade fucking to make sure we use McCaffrey less. If anything, you're gonna use McCaffrey more now because you have nobody besides Curtis Samuel who drops the fucking ball every time he gets the ball in his hands. Okay, you have Russell Shepard, who only plays on special teams. You have Brandon Burst, Brandon Barson, who's a special teams guy. Who do you what? What are you doing? Like I don't understand what you're doing. You know your fucking running game sucks. Your running game sucks. Okay, your running game is absolutely garbage. Two point three yards of carry is what we average. Thirtieth in the fucking NFL behind you. Like I don't, I don't get it. I don't understand. Like I don't I don't understand. I really I really fucking don't, I don't 
Like, I really don't. Like, what the fuck are you doing? Jerry Richardson just lets, you know, this thumbs back from the stupid decision that we fucking make as a fucking franchise. I don't understand. Like, can we, can we get a, can we trade? Like, can we get somebody else? Like, like, can we, can, like, what the fuck are we, what, what are we doing? Like, I don't, I don't understand. You got Boyd, which is okay. He's a speedy receiver, but he's plays on special teams. You got, you got the other guy we got from Buffalo off of waivers who was in Carolina originally, but got cut at the end of training camp. It was one of the last cuts. You got him. And then, you know, what are you doing? I don't understand what you're doing. Like, you got a 6'5 fucking receiver in Calvin Benjamin who can basically get up and get the ball whenever you want. You got Cam Newton who's playing like, like, you know, playing inconsistently as hell lately because, you know, you got a running game that fucking sucks dick, all right? It sucks. It absolutely sucks. And I don't care if I get I get deappetized or whatever the fuck it is. This shit's going on YouTube. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck if I get demonetized. I don't care. I'm putting the shit out. I don't give a fuck how much I'm cursing. I don't care because the NFL and the Panthers are stupid. Like, why would you let... Why, First of all, why would Jerry Richardson let this shit happen? Knowing that we have, you know, they're talking about you lo- using Christian McCaffrey less in the offense because we're depending so much on Christian McCaffrey. But in the way I see it, you're going to have to depend on Christian McCaffrey even more now because, you know, you know, Curtis Samuel isn't proven. He's, he's good, but he's not great. You got Russell Shepard. You got Devin Funches, who's going to have to be the leading receiver now because he's number one on the depth chart now. So, and you got Olsen coming back. I know Olsen's a great player. He's one of the best tight ends in the league. But what do you, like, what do you expect him to do? He's coming off an injury. Okay, you don't expect him to come out and beat Olsen until, like, you know, mid-season. Like, you know, it's going to take him a couple games to beat Olsen again. I just don't understand why you would make this fucking. I don't understand why you would make this trade. Um, but you know, I'm not. I'm not the. I'm not the fucking franchise. I can't. You know, this is just my opinion. I just think it's think it's stupid to be honest. I think it's absolutely fucking retarded that you know we would like we would absolutely do this trade right now. I don't. I don't get it. I don't. I don't get it. I think. I think it's it's a bad trade, you know. <laughs> this is this is a bad trade. I mean, I understand he's injured, but you know, what do you like? I understand his injuries and his contract was up, but you know, he's the top guy on the team. He leads, you know. Christian McCaffrey can't do everything, and now you're gonna have to depend on Funches even more to get what you need. Uh, I just don't. I don't get it, but. Then again, I'm not Jerry Richardson and the Carolina Panthers franchise. <laughs> so I guess we gotta see what happens. But, you know, if you want my opinion, it's a fucking stupid ass trade. I just don't, I don't get it. I don't understand. Especially since our running game is so bad. You know, it's ranked 30th in the NFL. Like, I just don't understand. And Cam's inconsistent as hell. You know, he come he, he can go out there and sling the ball and he can go out there, you know. You know, he just I don't understand why you make this trade. It's just I don't get it. But um like I said guys, I'm not the I'm not the Panthers, I'm not the I'm not Jay Richardson, I'm not this is just my opinion. Um so yeah. I'm just gonna leave it at that. Alright guys. Once again, Kevin Benjamin is traded from the Panthers to the Bills. I'll see what happens.